So today I'm gonna to share with you the top two things to integrate into your offering if you want to build a magnetic offer, specifically if you're a transformational coach. So today I'm going to share with you the top two things to integrate into your offering if you want to build a magnetic offer, specifically if you're a transformational coach. So I share this inside my program, Sacred Leader Academy, um, obviously in greater detail, but I'm going to summarize here for you now. So hopefully you can get some really good takeaways from today's video. The first thing you want to be able to do is tap into the divine wisdom that's flowing to you and meant to come through you. When you do this, you're literally communicating on the 5D with your soulmate clients. This is your intuitive guidance system, your soul team, your spirit, however you want to refer to it, speaking through you. This is essentially channeling. Um, as a multidimensional channel, I can say, I don't even know why I'm guided to say half the things that I say sometimes, but I hear them because I'm very clear audience and I know the things to say because it pops in as a knowing and then I say it. I trust it. If you talk to psychic mediums and things like that, that's one of the first things that they'll teach you. Or if you talk to other channels that are really good at their craft, they're going to tell you, you need to trust what's coming through. You need to say what's coming through. You need to speak what's coming through, or you need to write what's coming through or whatever. So this is part of opening to channeling and honoring the divine guidance that's coming through you. So recognize first and foremost that you are a vessel and you are a catalyst for change and transformation. Spirit is working through you. And when you make a commitment to your calling, spirit will use you. But you have to be open and allow it and you have to trust what's coming through. So First step is trust what's coming through. So many spiritual entrepreneurs I talk to, they receive downloads and guidance and then they stuff it away in a journal or they discount it or they discredit it or they get in their logical analytical brain about it or they fall into self-doubt, sabotage and imposter syndrome around it and they feel that they're not... Um, they're not qualified to share it for whatever reason. You don't need a certification to share the wisdom that's coming through, the ancient wisdom and the guidance that's coming through you. All you need to do is be an open channel. You don't need a certification for this. In fact, you don't need a certification to be a transformational coach, period. So that's the first thing is you want to trust the divine guidance, recognize that you're a vessel, allow yourself to be used because spirit is more than happy to use you for the highest and greatest good of all involved when you open yourself to that. The second thing I want to bring to your attention is that everything that you've been through, your trials and your tribulations and all of your successes and, and all of your, your valley moments and your dark nights of the soul and all of these things, they've all played in it a role in where you're at right now. Every job, every career choice, every pivot, every relationship, every health issue, every health crisis, um, all of it. All of it has served you and hidden within your own transformational story are nuggets of gold and nuggets of wisdom that I refer to with my clients as your key branding stories and your core defining moments that I help you get really clear on so you can resonate with the souls that you are here to serve because as a light worker teacher and healer you came here to lead by example which means part of your journey is to go through the trials and tribulations that you went through so you can come out the other side shining and even though you yes you are still in the process of becoming and yes there's always you're still on the journey and yes there is no end to this des there is no destination right you're, you're always becoming you're always in this process of evolving and up leveling you have made it through a certain leg of your journey so you can think of this as like a relay race right where each time you hand the baton you just I always picture this in my head and I share this with my clients. It's like you're running a race and you keep handing the baton off to your next level self. And so you've been up leveling, you've been up leveling and you've been up leveling. And each time you hand the baton off to your next level self, you step into a new version of you. 
Well, once you've done that and you've come full circle in your own transformational journey, this is where um, when the student is ready, the teacher will appear. Not only the teachers in your own life, your own mentors and stuff will appear, but also the teacher within will appear. And so while you're still a student on the journey and you're still a student of life, and you're still an evolving soul on this path, you also have something to share and give back in service to the highest and greatest good. And this is turning all of those wounds and all of those, those pains, those struggles, those obstacles, those triumphs, those successes, all of it, and using it for good to help someone else shorten their curve because they are still stuck where you were and now you get to help pull them through by being the wise mentor, guide, growth catalyst, energetic catalyst that you are simply by being in your presence, but also with the wisdom and everything that you've gleaned along the way. So when you that's so when you couple these two together, the divine downloads that you're receiving and you're trusting the guidance and you're allowing yourself to be used as the vessel for the highest and greatest good of all involved and you're sharing authentically um, your branding stories and core defining moments that really will resonate with your soulmate client. Now you have a, a soul aligned success formula that really makes your messaging magnetic and your offer magnetic. You went through the experiences you went through for a reason. Spirit knows all about it, right? Spirit's using your physical 3D experiences as a reference point for other people to resonate with you specifically. So when you start comparing yourself to other people and you're like, oh, well, she's doing this and she's doing that, listen, they're not you, no one can do it like you, and no one's supposed to do it like you, and no one has your story, and no one has your experiences. And spirit knows this, and spirit's ready to work through you if you allow it. So I hope this video resonates with you. If it did, please drop me a comment below this video wherever you happen to be watching it. And if this really, really resonates with you, then you're gonna love my Soul Align Success Masterclass, which you can find below this video. And if that resonates with you, see, I, I'm just all about resonating, right? If you resonate with me, there's a reason for it. If you resonate with my masterclass, there's a reason for it. If you do resonate with my masterclass, then you're going to get an invitation to hop on a 60 minute deep dive strategy session with me so I can help you map out a soul aligned six figure business uh, blueprint, six figure and beyond business blueprint, right? Something that really scales you for global massive impact while also um, building and maintaining a freedom-based, wellness-based lifestyle so you can have fun, freedom, and flexibility, which is what your soul craves. So if this really resonates with you, check out the Soul Align Success Masterclass. And again, I would love, love, love any feedback that you have regarding this content. Um, if you like the Soul Align Success series, please let me know. I know I have a lot of viewers out there that don't always comment. I'm one of those. I don't always comment on everything that I watch. Um, so I get that. Um, but if you do feel the urge to share, I would love to hear from you. And if you don't want to share publicly, please shoot me a DM and share privately and let me know that you wanted to keep the convo private. I'd still love to hear from you. So I hope this video finds you well, and I look forward to tuning in with you again very soon. Namaste.